knows he's scrappy. He can score the basketball. He can assist the basketball. can get his own shot. He's tremendous in pick and roll. Played with Dwight Howard. Now, we don't know if Dwight's back, but... The thing that Rondo did so well was play pick and roll with AD, play pick and roll with LeBron. Schroeder can play pick and roll with those two guys and can pull up and shoot the jumper where you had to worry about uh, uh, Rondo driving to the basket. You got to worry about Schroeder shooting the basketball. He's a much better shooter than, than, than Rondo, and I believe he's a better driver of the ball than Rondo. Now, is he a better guy running the offense than Rondo? Absolutely not. Rondo's been an elite-level point guard, and he can still play at an extremely high level. Mm. But, Skip, Rondo's about to be 35. The question is, the Lakers at some point in time, they know, realize they got to start getting younger. And Rondo has, over the, his history, especially in the last five or six years, has missed significant amounts of time. So you got to factor that in. Rondo's looking for a big payday. We don't got that kind of cheese, Skip. Mm. Not for guys like that. We only we saving our cheese. Mm. Got uh, uh, AD, you know, Ron, uh, Bron could opt that next year. Mm. So he gonna opt that. He gonna want another pay, one of them $40, 40 million dollar payday because we doing an NBA a favor by, mm. you know, okay, we gonna sign off and going back, but you know, we gonna need that cap to go up so I can get paid. So he's gonna be the anti Brady and take more. Don't worry about this. Ain't got nothing to do with Brady. Mm. We gonna get rings. We gonna pass Brady with rings. So don't you worry uh, about us. Don't you worry did, about did us. Did you just go there? <laughs> yes, you, I went you there. You know, and I know that <laughs> that ain't happening. That's gonna happen. So Skip, look. He can also take Braun off the ball. He can run the offense if Braun's on the bench. He can also take Braun off the ball if Braun's on the court. Let Braun, A, take a break. A, true to do your thing. Dance with him right quick. You and AD having that. Because, you know, we got to be judicious with our time and our energy and our effort the first part of this season because you know we just it just got our ring, Skip. Man, can't even enjoy our celebration. I mean, you know, I'm supposed to go around and be able to, you know, now I think they do it like they do hockey. Everybody get the Stanley Cup and you take it around. So I hadn't even got my chance to hold, have a trophy and take it back to Akron, mm-hmm. to our promise school and go around with the trophy. I was already back, because you mentioned he already back in the gym, mm-hmm. in that lab, getting them shots up. He better be. Don't worry about us. But anyway, Skip, the Lakers defense, I, I like it. I like Schroeder. I like this uh, uh, pickup. And the thing that I like most is that Rob Palenka is not standing pat. He understands is that when you win a championship, you can't run it, oh, run it back. Nah, we can't run it back with the same people. Gonna come back a little different, a little stronger, a little better. Repeat. The problem Palinka has is a number of those people don't want to run it back because they're running elsewhere. Yeah, they want to run it back. Okay. If we had money, if we had the money to give Rondo, guarantee he'd be back. I guarantee he wouldn't be. Guarantee. Back. But that's what we do. We get to pay. We about to get Rondo paid. Dwight Howard. What Dwight Howard say? Dwight Howard about to get paid. That's what we do. We get people paid. J.R., Tristan, Della Vadova, Mozgov. We get you paid. The bag man will pay you. Mm. <laughs> Is that it? Yep. Thank you. My turn. I will be the first to give you that Schroeder has flat out dog in him. He plays with an edge, with a nastiness, with a, a tenacity yep. that I love. He, he, he's coming off the bench for the most part. And, and he will change the whole tempo and energy of the game when he comes into it. Yep. He is afraid of nobody. That's what I like. And he's only about 6'1", so he has to play more with his heart and his guts yes. than his, his physique and stature, mm-hmm. right? So on flat-out dogness, he will be able to replace Rajon Rondo. Rondo, I think, is headed for the Clippers. We, we will probably hear this about... 6 p.m. Eastern today when those deals can be announced. Maybe it'll leak before then. It's going to be in the State Farm Center. <clears throat> What's that? It's going to be in the State Farm. That's Atlanta. Oh, you think so? Now, wh- why would he take the money and run to Atlanta to back up Trey Young? What does it give- wh- Why would you do that? Wh- what's the why point? Would he ta- why would he and, stay and here and back up Pat Bell? And to finish 10th in the Eastern Conference and miss the playoffs. No, get them in the playoffs the last time uh, the Hawks been to the playoffs. Get them in the playoffs. Rondo will be the starting point guard for the Clippers <laughs> next year. And the point that you continue to miss, although I think deep down you recognize it and, and it horrifies you, is that Rondo is more valuable in the biggest picture than Schroeder ever thought about being because Rondo's just a better player than Schroeder all around because Rondo has accolades that Schroeder never dreamed of having. And if you look at their, their career numbers, they're, they're similar, except Rondo's go up in the playoffs. They yeah. go significantly up because he is playoff Rondo. Schroeder is not playoff Schroeder. In fact, all of his stats go down. 
he, he's he's 14 points during the regular season. It goes down to 13. Three rebounds down to two. Five assists go down to four. Uh, he, he averaged 26 minutes in regular season games down to 23 because his coach is just saying, you know, he works in the regular season, but he doesn't work as well in the postseason. So that's who you just acquired. But, and he's got flat out dog in it. Yeah, flat out dog in it. But you may, you notice when them guys play with Gold Jane, what happened? Mm. The minutes go up. Look at Caruso. What did he play in the regular season? What did he play in the playoff? Mm. Mar- uh, uh, Keith Morris. Mm. What did he play in the regular season? What did he do in the playoff? Dwight Howard. What did he do in the regular season? What did he do in the playoff? Mm. That's what we do, Skip. Do you understand what we have? What we have is, is infectious. Mm. You get a ride us. Sometimes you just touch the hem of his garment. You remember that? You remember that? Mm. You think you that guy. You shake that guy's hand, you hug him, you know he's in the huddle. You like, something comes over you, Skip. Did, did you just call LeBron? No, 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 Skip you, Skip, you already know what's going to happen, Skip. You already know what's going to happen. You know this. So just for those who have lost touch with this, Rajon Rondo has led the entire playoffs in assists twice in his career. He's led the NBA in assists three times. Yes. He, he has led the NBA in steals one year. He is a made man. Yes. He's got pedigree. He yeah. has stature. He's on the cusp of being a Hall of Famer. All he needs to do is go downstairs to the Clippers in the basement of Staples Center, bring them upstairs into the spotlight, beat the Lakers this year in the playoffs, and win a third ring with a third team. That's, that's all presumptuous of you. But, Skip, I give you all that. We're not questioning what Rondo has done, but we the injury history is there. And he's about he's about to be 35. He's about to be 35. Mm-hmm. Now, if you're gonna tell me we're just gonna hey. He's a young 35. He's got one of those bodies you just roll out of bed and play playoff Skip, basketball. You remember he didn't play in the playoff games? Remember? He gets he hurt injured. occasionally. Yeah, occasionally. Yeah, he but, was hurt. but when it's time, he's there. But that's the thing though, Skip. We understand that. And we saw that last year. Remember his first year? He got hurt. Last year, he got hurt. Okay. So I, I'm not. I'm not de- right. so de- doubting to, what he is. Back to your man, LeBron's quote. <clears throat> Got no quarrel with the first half of the quote, but now we get to the second half. What is the second half? Flat out dog who's joining a pack of pack. dogs. What pack of dogs? Maybe a, maybe a pack of kitties. Like, hyenas. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Hyenas. Kitty, 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 kitty. Hey. Skip, you what, saw what we did. Wait, wait a second. As great as LeBron is, as as gifted and, and as great a performer as he's been, does he have flat out dog in him? Flat out. No. See, 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 That's see. the problem. Jordan had flat out dog. LeBron doesn't. That's the essence of why Jordan is the goat. LeBron is not. Yeah, here's There's the, no killer instinct. You know what in I know, LeBron. If you know, you you're a dog lover. The thing is that anybody tell you about a dog, the dog that you should fear is not the one that barking. It's the one that doesn't <laughs> bark. I had a dog skip. He didn't do no barking. Named Samson, called him Bo. Mm. He was an Akita. Mm. Do no barking. Yeah, but an Akita can, he's got the stature to bring it. Yep, that's yep. exactly right. Okay. Now, I got the little, got the little Pomeranians. All they do is bark. Ain't gonna do nothing. Mm. Ain't, gonna bust, ain't gonna bust a grape in a fruit fight. Mm. But that guy right see, Skip, what you've done, and LeBron has allowed y'all to do this. Y'all take his kindness for weakness. Mm. Y'all see his generosity. He y'all is see- a nice guy. Yes! Like, and y- too nice. And y'all take that Y'all yep. take that for, oh, he weak, he ain't no dog. Mm. But don't let that fool you. Okay, now let's go to his co-star, Anthony Davis. Nothing but. Got no dog in it. All dog. I, I am sorry, he's got none. Skip. Incredibly gifted. It- Remember what y'all told? Y'all told me. I don't know if AD got that dog. Mm. I don't know if he's on that big stage. Could he rise to the moment? Yeah, Charles asked, Barkley kept saying that. Did he check the boxes? Mm. I want to know, did he check the boxes? He checked, he, he checked the bubble boxes. I'll give you that. Skip, what about the regular season? The guy was first team all NBA. First team all defensive. Should have been defensive player of the year. What mm. other box do you need to see? Mm. I need to see him win an out-of-the-bubble championship. No, no. What you want to see... When wh- everybody is committed, all the other teams are actually committed to being in the playoffs as opposed to going home. Skip, yeah, hold on. So they, they, could, they didn't have to come. I want uh, to see him win an NBA Finals against a team that, that somehow manages to stay full strength instead of losing in Game 1. It's leading playoff score and it's heart and soul player. Well, no, in no, Game no, no. 1, they're gone. No, 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 no. 
What I want to see happen is your team not blow a 3-1 lead mm. with, with the best player in the NBA, Kawhi Leonard. Everybody, there are a lot of people that say Kawhi Leonard was the best player. And how you lose 3-1? Aha. Uh -huh. Let there be Rondo. That's how you avoid that. But no, no. Give me Rondo. None of those three games happen. That's over in five games. The thing that I Thank love you. about history is that it cannot be erased. Mm. Now, we can teach you about it so it does not happen again, but you <laughs> yeah. cannot erase it. Yeah. So that's on his resume. Unlike, just like you, every time I start talking about my guy, what do you go back to? 2011. He can't, first of all, once that happened, 2011, it's disqualified. He's